stand tall. But yeah, if you don't stand tall, you'll win the arm wrestle. This is about losing forever. Get up sooner. Good. Again. It almost feels as though that once the club, when the arm comes into the ball, the elbow is in front of the wrist, and then from there, the elbow is closer to the sky than the wrist. Good job. Oh, cuts. Give me another one. Okay, again, same move. If you lose your balance, you didn't get tall enough at the end. Okay. okay. Got it? Okay. Up and through. Okay. Art is part of this, mm -hmm. right? But finding a way to get it early, right? Big turn of the body. Get that elbow feeling like it's losing it. Okay, so I got it here. Now from here I'm going to go up and through. And then I want to fake it at the end. Fake it at the end. It's going to feel like the club. It's like that way. Right? Like the, the club. Yeah, the club never ends up going to that side of your right arm. Because that straightens you out. It's here. And up. So... The club is always going to stay to the left of this right arm today. And I want it to feel like it's slow and soft with the arms, other than the twist, and harder with your pivot. So find it early. Good. Okay. Up, hit it, yeah, and find it at the end. There you go, that's it, that's the feel. Like you can't hook it for your life that way. Okay, another one. Yep. That's it. Good. So just just like that. Don't do anything more than that. It goes as far as it goes. Okay. One more. Get tall with that finish. Come look. Ended early, that Mike Weir half back swing. Good. And then from here, tall with the finish, low with the handle.
Cool. Give me that one again. Hands, handle low. I don't care if the club head goes back up again, just handle lower. Good. One more time. Draw down, Mike. Draw down, yeah. Get it all together. When that turns, you pull it. When that straw points that way, ball goes that way. Yeah. Okay, hold your finish here, Joel. I'm going to move you, okay? Yeah. Hold it. Okay, so lower body's really good. Show me another one. Give you a practice swing. Yeah, and now on the way through, keep your stomach over your thighs. There. If you lean back, that's the same thing as pulling away. So the, lean, the, the leaning back is letting your left arm take off all by itself. But if you go from here, right, lose the arm wrestle, the whole waiter thing right here, if you keep that down, I can keep it there. But if it goes this way and you, you back up too much, that's where you throw it up. So it might feel like chest stays pointed at the ground from here on in. Yeah, there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, nice shot. Better, way better. Right. Yeah, okay. I was always an online guy. Yep. Yes, for sure. Yeah. And so I think you lose that when you start to pull your stomach away from your thighs early. Okay. So then this is a reaction. Yeah, so keep keep the angle at the at the hip. Okay. Keep that angle. the losing the arm wrestle okay just keep it there then all right so as you come through okay the more that this goes down and this goes out 
the more you're over your thighs already. And then stay there as you go through. One more time, take it up to the top. So chest to this point has to get closer. Good, and now turn around the corner with that. There, there. You're gonna feel your head dive to the right and go forward with us. No backing up, Back, move in and move through. Yes. For the club? Yeah. Your leg's standing up. Right? You go you went like this. Your legs stood up, which throws the pelvis back and therefore throws the chest down. Okay. Run out of juice. Can you put all the ladies' gloves aside? I gotta figure out what to do with those. If there are any more mediums. Okay. Looks different. Too fast. Rushed. If you're rushing, it's all arms. Okay, so one more time, set up to it. I want you to feel like your grip in your forearms are like one out of 20 pressure. Like just super light. Even through here, you can twist the elbow around the shoulder and still hold this thing super light. But if you're squeezing, it's ready to win. It's ready to fold out and win the race. Or win the arm, the arm wrestle. Nice. So more stomach over thighs to end up with a lower finish with the handle. And then we should some drivers soon. Give me like three quarter speed so you can hit these things. Three quarter speed so you can hit the finish and the arm. Hold it. That was a pretty good move there, huh? Like, I moved you a lot. I moved you a lot. Okay, do it again. There you go. Good. So like from where I'm standing here, you're still finishing really tall. It, you're not, you don't look like this, but I know you're trying to get there. Another one. One more. Where those ended up. Yeah. 
So still like straight, definitely not above your head, more wrapped around you, but get them down. Get them down to the ground. The handle's too high in the finish. So just hold it longer. Yeah. While the pivot keeps going. Yeah. So set up to your shot. I'm gonna give you one different idea on this. Okay, so take it to the top, bend that left shoulder the best you can, okay? So when this goes back and it goes up here, the space between these two has to stay the same. You have to keep the elbow bent the same. So I'm going to, so right here, don't let that space continue. Look at the ball. Don't spread it out. How do you move this part so that the space stays the same? Keep going, keep going, good, there. And now from here, this can dump out into the ground. But what we've got going on, take it up to the top. Okay, you have too much of this going on, where that takes off away from this. And that's why I talked about trying to get your left shoulder under your chin, right, even in front of your chin, before you looked up. So once we have the left shoulder twisting the arm the way we need it to, make the shoulder move longer. It's the shoulder that's going to hit the ball. Yes, like that. Okay, so wave at it with that feel and that motion. Just wave at it. No speed. Again. So it almost feels like I'm trying to, trying to hit the right form with the left shoulder. Cool. And then it stays that way. Yeah. Yep, okay. Yep. So just trying to collide. Yep, until you end up in like a crunch. Yep. There. Better. Better, better, better. So when you finish your swing and you're watching it, try to feel like you can lower your hands again and then push your chest down to the ground. Do a crunch. I, want, I really want you to try to feel like you finish this way. There we go. Come look at that. Yeah, good. Good. 